Hey guys, it's Kathy from Crafty Chica and today I have a resin project for you. Ice Resin sent me just about one of everything that they have in stock right now and I was really excited to put these all to use and just have a great playtime. In addition to the two-part resin kit, they sent me a variety of papers and templates and bezels and paintbrushes, even paper sealer. But in addition to all of this, if you want to work with resin and make jewelry, I would suggest using a piece of cardboard on a nice flat surface and wax paper because that way the resin, when it cures, if it spills over, it won't stick to anything. You can easily remove it. Ooh, there's some glitter too. Okay, the first thing I did, I thought I would create backgrounds for all of the bezels. For the papers, I used the paper sealer, which also works as an adhesive, and I just lined that in there, and I put paper on the back or glitter on the back of all the bezels. You can see I also use some of the enamels, the cold enamels around the edges, and I filled all of these with the paper or, or glitter, and then I mixed the resin. So you want to measure equal parts into the little cup. They make it very easy. One part of part A, one part of part B, and fold it together for a few minutes and let it set for about 10 minutes to remove any of the gas bubbles. That is really important. You can also use a straw to blow out any bubbles, but if you let it set, the gas bubbles will dissipate on their own. So here I am adding a first layer of resin to all of these and it's pretty simple. You just add a, you know, a, a little layer and I like to let it cure then I'll add a second layer if I'm embedding things that way it gives it a layered look and this is a bezel that I made from wire and I put duct tape on the back and that way once it cures you can just peel off the duct tape and then you have a really cool translucent look to your wire bezel that you made. I added some of the dye there that you can see. So here's the finished pieces. I let them cure overnight. These are, this was a big blob of red that I put down and before it was fully cured I just cut it out with scissors, the, cut these different shapes. And these you can see I layered different pictures on top and I added a coat of resin on top of those too, letting each coat dry in between. And they came out so cool. You can use just about anything as a bezel, a bottle cap, any kind of plastic caps, even little boxes. You can make your own bezels from wire like I did. Oh look, I trimmed those in crystals also. Okay, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and check out my site, craftychica.com, for even more resin projects like this. Bye!